Hey guys, I'm Jamie and I'm the PDHPE lecturer for ATAR Notes. Today we'll be talking about identifying priority health issues. So this is a tool that helps the government provide the most appropriate allocation of resources to the health sector for the development and implementation of curative services and health promotion initiatives. This is almost always assessed in the HSE exam, so let's go through the criteria. One, social justice principles, equity, diversity, and supportive environments. How will these be achieved if we identify priority health issues? Two, priority population groups. Who are the most vulnerable to these health issues or who experiences the poorest health outcomes? This could be the indigenous population or people of low socioeconomic status. Three, prevalence of the condition. It's important that the health issues affecting the most amount of people are the ones prioritised. Four, potential for prevention and early intervention. A lot of these health issues are caused by modifiable risk factors, which means that they can be changed and prevented. If we do these now, then we can save resources in the future. Five, costs to the individual and the community. What are the monetary costs of medications and hospitalisation as well as the emotional burden and stress experienced by those affected by the health issue. Those with the greatest costs should be the ones prioritised. Thanks for watching.